Good afternoon, I'm Craig from Rise Bikes and today I'm going to show you how to remove and replace your dropout torque sensor. The only tool you're going to need is the 5mm Allen key. Four bolts you're going to work on is right here. This will detach the derailleur from the dropout. And then these three bolts will remove the torque sensor dropout from the frame. Now, once you've unhooked the derailleur, you're going to want to be careful with this. You do want to lay it down somewhere gently, as you don't want to misalign it by bumping it around too much. Next, remove the three. These are going to be very tightly bolted in. It may seem like they're impossible to move, and you will probably hear a creak or a, or a single crack sound. That is okay. That is simply just how tight they are. Once of course you've detached it, be sure to unplug it and also remember to remove your battery before unplugging any of the plugs unless otherwise specified. And there you go, a removed dropout torque sensor. Replacing it just as easy. You line it up. Obviously you don't want to put the bolt too tight for the first one. You want to make sure all three have been lined up. Now, once all three have been lined up again, now you can tighten them to their full tightness. And you'll want to tighten them as, these as much as possible. Now, you'll want to gently grab your derailleur. Once you've plugged it in, of course, making sure that the notch is lined up and the plug pops in securely, that is everything you need to do to replace the torque sensor. 